A car ending up in a canal. A person rushed to the hospital and tonight crews have removed another body from the water. Now we're learning more about the race to the rescue uh, to rescue the people inside. Local 10's Christian De La Rosa is live in Sunrise with our top story. Christian. There were heroic efforts to try to save both of these victims. In the end, the scene would turn deadly. And now police are trying to figure out if there was foul play involved or if this was just a horrifying accident. The desperate search went into the night. Depth is about 20 to 25 feet deep. Uh, our fire rescue divers advised it is very uh, weed fested, a lot of downed trees very murky water, uh, certainly almost like a seaweed type. It was just before 5.30 Wednesday afternoon. Witnesses say this Buick drove into this canal off of University Drive and Oakland Park Boulevard with two people inside, both seen making it out of the car. They actually were attempting to swim, uh, but apparently could not swim and they, they went back underwater. A staff member and a student from this nursing school next door jumped in. Uh, one of our employees also jumped in um, to try and help. Obviously, none of the three could do anything. The car was well in submerged and at that point, and all they could see were the bubbles coming up. Sunrise Fire Rescue, Sunrise Police, and BSO dive teams responding. Within minutes, they pulled out one of the victims, a woman who was rushed to a nearby hospital. But it took nearly two hours for divers to make the tragic recovery. The body of a man pulled out of the water. At this point, neither of the victims have been identified and we are standing by for an update on the woman's condition. At last check, she is still alive. Live in Sunrise, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10 News.